Holy Cross of Prayer for April 26th, 2021. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I am the Good Shepherd. The Good Shepherd lays down his life for the sheep. And a reading from Acts chapter 4. On the next day their rulers and elders and scribes gathered together in Jerusalem with Annas the high priest and Caiaphas and John and Alexander and all who were of the high priestly family. And when they had set them in the midst, they inquired, By what power or by what name did you do this? Then Peter, filled with the Holy Spirit, said to them, Rulers of the people and elders, if we are being examined today concerning a good deed done to a crippled man, by what means this man has been healed? Let it be known to all of you and to all the people of Israel that by the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, whom you crucified, whom God raised from the dead, by him this man is standing before you well. This Jesus is the stone that was rejected by you, the builders, which has become the cornerstone. And there is salvation in no one else, for there is no other name under heaven given among men by which we must be saved. Just as the rulers, elders, and scribes had tried to trip up Jesus to catch him in order to silence him, they are now turning to the disciples. Obviously, their attempts to silence Jesus by torturing him and crucifying him didn't work. His word cannot be imprisoned or captured or quieted. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, bless Gary with faith in you and fervent love toward all those who cross his path this day. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Almighty God, merciful Father, since you have wakened from death the shepherd of your sheep, grant us your Holy Spirit, that when we hear the voice of our shepherd, we may know him who calls us each by name and follow where he leads. Through the same Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Amen.